Okay, adding and removing people from your Google Groups. First of all, you need to be an administrator of this before you can do it. Uh, you'll have to check with someone else on that part. But once you do have that, you can go to your Waffle. I'll just read search from my Gmail. Click on your Waffle up here in the corner and pick Groups. It'll load up your Groups. As you can see, I'm in a lot of Groups. Uh, click on your school group, the one you're trying to manage in this case, Mine's Mary Queen of Peace. And you can see a list of conversations that are happening here. But we'll, what we really care about is the members. So when you click on people, it gives you a list of all the people in your groups. If you want to remove someone, you click on the check mark right next to their name, and you get a new option over here to either remove the little dash or ban. Now, we don't need to ban anyone, but when we click remove, we can remove someone from our group. And you can check as many people as you need to remove. And if you want to add people, right here at the top, you see add members. Click add members. And you just need to put in their email addresses or their names. So say I was trying to add Aaron Daw. Click. And say I wanted to add another Aaron. Um, Aaron. Oh, that's not a real person. Myself. My email shows up. There's my tailor. All right, so these are just members. You don't want to add managers or owners, just members. You can put in a quick local message. Welcome to our school. And the subscription type, most of the time, it's going to want to be all the emails. Uh, you have a couple of those. Digest just gives you like one email a day with a list of everything. I can't remember what abridged is, and none is if you want to receive none emails. But you're usually going to leave this as all, and that's it. Hit add members, and you're done.